guys, my name is Cam and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So as you can tell by the title of this video and all of the stuff in front of me, today I'm going to be reorganizing my entire Solgi collection who is my ultimate bias of K-pop. And in addition to reorganizing, I'm also going to be storing everything in this new 2 inch binder as opposed to this smaller 1.5 inch binder. So I'm going to be transferring all of my pages and also I'm probably going to be like reordering everything since a lot of the stuff in this old binder is not in chronological order so i'd like to fix that in this video but yeah before i get started just a reminder to like comment and subscribe since this video is about to be super long and yeah let's just get right into it so the first thing that I'm going to do is take everything out of this binder just so that I can reorganize it chronologically. So I'm gonna have to take out every single photo card and every single sticker pretty much. And I'm going to start organizing them in a chronological order pretty much, but the postcards and the photos can pretty much stay in the same order, I think. Okay, so now that I've taken out all of the photo cards that I previously had in my binder, I've also taken out all of the placeholders as well. So all of these ones with the green frog tab mean that I now have them. So this is actually a considerable amount of cards that I have to put away. And these yellow ones mean that they're on the way. So I'll also be putting these in as placeholders pretty much. And then these with no tab mean that I still haven't bought them or I still haven't found them yet for a decent price. So pretty much I won't be putting these in since I think it's really discouraging with all of my empty spaces. Like with my old binder, it made me really sad when I saw all of the empty spaces, so I won't be putting these back in. And now I'll be integrating all of these photo cards that I've received in my last few collective hauls into all of these piles, just so that they're all in chronological order. And yeah, let's just get into the time lapse. Okay, so now that I'm finally done putting everything into chronological order and into stacks by era, I'm now finally going to begin putting them into nine pocket sleeves. This is gonna take a while and I don't really know how I'm going to put this on camera since, I don't know, I don't think I'm gonna have room to fit a whole nine pocket page on the screen, but I'll try figuring it out and let's get into the time lapse again.
Okay guys, so now that I finally reorganized all of my photo cards into these nine pocket pages, I'm now going to transition all of these along with my three pocket and two pocket pages into my new binder. So here's my new binder. It's just a plain white binder like the old one, except it's two inches and I've already added the cover inside. So yeah, let's start moving everything into my new binder. took a lot longer than I thought it would. I started filming at around 5.30ish and it's now 7.50 so that took around like two hours. I really really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I'm not really sure how long it is since I time lapsed everything but hopefully it was a substantial amount of content for you guys. I'm not going to be doing a flip through today since I want to save that for a updated collection video so definitely look forward to that. And yeah that's pretty much going to bring me to the end of this video. As usual don't forget to like comment and subscribe. Stay safe, stay healthy, stay loud and I'll see you in my next video. Peace.